Hello, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Dollar Tree Gold. So I know I've been doing a lot of bath time videos from Dollar Tree. That's pretty much what I like have in my stock and that's what I can find at my local Dollar Tree. But this week I do have a super duper like name brand. And I was super surprised to find these at Dollar Tree. You probably saw this when I was doing my Christmas videos, but it is the Ahava Dead Sea Mineral Bath Soak. And uh, I'm super excited to try these. Um, these are expensive, so if you'd like to see if these are any good, uh, if you'd like to hear how much these are originally, then please keep on watching. Like it says, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell, you can even bookmark the page. Let's get started. Okay, so found these at Dollar Tree, did a little haul with them, said they'd make an awesome holiday gift, but I haven't tried them yet. But this is from the brand Ahava, which I tried a few things from them. They have it's a good brand. These are like ten or fifteen dollars, so you do get eleven ounces. So yeah, but this is Dead Dead Sea Salt, natural Dead Sea bath salts, and um, yeah, it's rich in skin friendly minerals, including magnesium, calcium, potassium, and more. These powerful salts soothe your body with genuine relaxation. And then you're supposed to dissolve one to two packets in a hot bath and soak for 15 to 20 minutes. So let me go in and show you how much these are. Like here's a screenshot of this exact same product. I mean, I can't believe that these were at Dollar Tree. Um, I love bath salts. I use Dr. Teal's mostly, but I'm always in the market to try new ones. I love the packaging. I just think it looks really, really classy, simple, but let's go in and try these. Hello. Okay, so I've been soaking in the tub for probably about 15 minutes. And I have to say, I really like the Ahava, I have them right here. I really like the Ahava Dead Sea Salts. Um, really, really good bath soak. Absolutely no scent, um, no color. Just, it's like you're putting, you know, like putting nothing in your bath, which is something I do like. They remind me a lot of the pink Himalayan bath salts. Those were just pink Himalayan salt. Um, very, very similar. Um, it definitely seems to leave the skin feeling kind of slick, which if there's all those minerals in there, it's not a big surprise. But I like these a lot. Um, do I think they're worth the original price? Yes and no. I mean, it being imported from the Dead Sea, I totally get the price. Ahava is an expensive brand, so totally understand. Totally worth a dollar, dollar twenty-five, whatever. Um, these are really, really nice bath salts. I only used about half a bag, um, but yeah, it's Mara salt, Dead Sea salt. That's the only ingredient. Um, I They're great. It's really, really nice. Vegan, um, it's eco-friendly, and they're just really, really nice. I, I like these a lot. Definitely, definitely recommend the Ahava Dead Sea salt bath salts if you can find them at your local Dollar Tree. Even with the prices have gone up, totally worth it. Um, I, I have like three other bags. Totally glad I did purchase backups. Um, it's nice that I could still wash my face. No kind of irritation or anything like that. With other bath salts, obviously, like the Dr. Tills, anything with added perfume or color, I don't wash my face when I get in the tub. I like will do it in the sink or I'll do it while my tub is draining and stuff like that. But with these, it's just dead sea salt. That's all it is. Kind of like the pink Himalayan salts. So yeah, totally like these. Totally worth the money. I, I've never seen such a high-end brand being at Dollar Tree ever in my life. And I've been shopping at Dollar Tree ever since we got one here in my town. So 10 years, probably close to that. So totally recommend the Ahava Dead Sea Salts. They're great. Um, and I like that there's no scent to them. I like that there's no perfume. It's just Dead Sea Salt. So enjoy that. It feels like I'm almost on a little mini vacation at the Dead Sea. So totally recommend them. Definitely Dollar Tree Gold. If you can find them at your local Dollar Tree, 
pick them up. I don't think you'd be disappointed. I think they'd make an awesome Valentine's Day gift. I think that they'd make just a great thing to put in your guest bathroom. I don't know. It just elevates. I don't know. It just feels fancy to me. And I know I'm, I'm like super frugal and everything like that. They just feel fancy. And for a dollar, dollar twenty-five, totally worth the money. But anyway, there we go. Um, I hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments if you found the Ahava Dead Sea bath salts at your local Dollar Tree. What did you think of them? I would love to know down below. And of course, you are welcome to follow me on my social media, Facebook and Instagram, and it is at Budget Land Babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start autoplaying here very shortly, or you can always click on one of the ones that will be popping up right on the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.